Good morning, boys and girls, and welcome to our Friday lineup. Let's bow our heads and pray. Dear Lord, today I ask for courage. There are things that I may face today, and Lord, I need courage to face all of these trials in my life. I need the kind of courage that you gave Nehemiah, that he was able to speak to a king and build a wall, even in the face of opposition. I pray that when opposition comes my way, you will make me brave. Put the words in my mouth to calm the storm that rises up against me. Even though I may be fearful, I know that you are my protector. Thank you, Father God. In Jesus' name, amen. So that's why I was on very upset this morning because you know it's lockdown and other than having to teach you all day long, I have to clean the house and I keep on telling the boys to help me and to look after themselves but lo and behold, what did I find this morning? An empty banana peel just left on the counter and I keep on telling them to throw the empty banana peels in the bin and then a dirty mug and a dirty knife and I keep on telling them if I use dishes, then wash the stuff. And the worst is an empty toilet roll. How many times do I tell the children, if you finish a toilet roll, you go to the cupboard, you fetch a toilet roll and you replace it. So I'm going to call the boys to the kitchen and we'll see what they've got to say for themselves. Boys, can you please explain yourselves? Okay. 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 Mom, this is mine. Uh, but I was going to come back and wash it. You know how I love washing dishes. Uh, I do. But I was... Uh, and you, are you right? I just have a massive headache. Sorry. Um, Mom, you know how I love washing dishes. And uh, I was coming back. I just had something very important on my computer to do. The toilet roll? Okay. To be, I don't even know this is, Mom. To be honest, I don't even need toilet paper. No, that's just disgusting. Uh, excuse me, Andrew. Mom said, if you can't see something nice... Don't say anything at all. The banana peel. Okay, I can explain. So, I ate this at tea time, and I want to recycle because I want to go green and save the planet. Um, but I left it here because I don't know where to recycle it. 
So I'm just gonna do my research. Uh, don't touch it. And then once I find a place, I'm gonna uh, that place called a dustbin, Andrew. Mona said, if you don't have something nice to say, you don't say it at all. Boys, this is completely unacceptable. Josh, what are you doing with all the toilet paper? I'm taking it to my room so that I don't have to keep on going back and fetch it. I thought you don't even use toilet paper. Everybody does your job. Josh, what are you doing? Making a peanut butter sandwich. Why aren't you using a knife? Because then I don't need to wash the knife. Hmm, that's a smart idea. Andrew, what are you doing? I'm eating a banana. What does it look like? Uh, it looks like you need to peel it. No, why would I do that? <laughs> then I have to throw the peel away. Plus, I actually like to enjoy eating a banana like this. Uh, Andrew, that is very strange. And secondly, it's disgusting. Oh, most of you don't have anything else to say? Don't say it at all. Uh, Andrew, you know what you're right. That's a very smart idea. I have no clue why no one on this planet hasn't thought of that before. I actually am going to do that myself right now. Well, you should, because I think it's delicious. So, Great Fives, thank you so much for watching episode 3 with us. And remember to clean up after yourselves. And if, if you, you can't, can't say something nice, don't, don't say, say it at all. Okay, cheers, guys. Cheers, guys. So this morning, look what I found. An empty banana. <laughs> and the toilet roll? I don't even know who this is. I don't even need toilet paper. No, that's just so <laughs> Wow, Mrs. Holt, Andrew and Josh, what an important message. Thank you so much for sharing. Boys and girls, going into this week, I'd like for you to remember your online etiquette. And remember, if you can't say anything nice, don't say it at all. Before I go, I'd like to remind you to please use your weekly checklist to tick off the tasks that you need to upload. Please go into next week with courage. Be strong, be brave, and be courageous. Have an amazing weekend.